How's it going, everybody? We're back, playing Don't Starve. It's been a few days since I was last here. Uh, I'm gonna be honest, I don't quite remember what we were doing last, but... Taking a look around, it just seems like, uh, things are doing alright. Oh, that's right, we're about to get attacked. Alright, well, let's prepare ourselves, get our log suit on, drop our backpack right there. Uh, I don't think we're gonna need... Here, let's, let's eat a few carrots. We're gonna get, uh, ambushed by some angry coyotes or whatever these things are and oh my gosh look at all these berry bushes this is great we've got all these berries uh, once we deal with these guys uh, where are they at come at me I'm ready for you Oh, are they coming from the north are they coming from the east coming from the south they're definitely not coming from the west either that or they're gonna have to swim over where are you guys at Show yourselves. Get out of here, bird. You don't want to have to witness this. Got to, can't have any witnesses. This is going to be a bloodbath. We are going to take these guys down without prejudice. Do I have any logs, by the way? Oh, I don't have any logs. I should probably position myself near uh, a tree or something so that when I totally own these guys, I can prepare for night. Where are these guys? Get over here. All right, here's a tree. Uh, that might not be enough wood. Let's look for a bigger tree. Oh, look at these. What are you doing? Come over here. Lay off that wall. There we go. Yeah. You're going down, you son of a bitch. Look at that. Oh, man. We took him down. Piece of cake. Absolute cakewalk. For some reason, he was up there attacking that wall. I'm not sure why. But we took care of him either way. And he was not a problem at all. Uh, chop down this tree. Got a few more seconds until dusk. And, yep, look. Sun setting on day 19. Oh, man, we're almost into day 20. This is going pretty well. Uh, if I do remember correctly, last time uh, I found a nice little area to the south of here. And I think that's something that might be worth exploring soon enough. Let's let's run back to our house. Uh, throw our backpack. Oh, I guess we don't have our backpack anymore. Where'd that go? Here it is. Let's grab our backpack, throw that back on, and put our log suit right back where it was. And then we can grab these logs. Let's actually turn these logs into some boards. Where is this? Refine. Get some boards. Take those boards. Uh, we'll hold on to them for a second longer. Do we have a good meal for tonight? Um, we got some carrots. We're going to want to hold on to these seeds now that we have farms up at our food base. But, yeah, it looks like we could use some berries. So let's let's collect some berries real quick. We have a few more ticks left on the clock until it's uh, Super Night. Uh, oh, by the way, Super Night looks like it's getting a little long. Hey, oh, hey, get the hell out of here. Oh, did you see that? Yeah, get out of here, you stupid turkey. You don't belong here. These are my bushes. Oh, son of a turkey. Alright, let's add this uh, these logs to the fire. Let's start roasting up these carrots. Uh, we don't, we're not too hungry, but it'd be good to top off uh, sort of while we're still ahead. Oh, look at the winterometer. Oh, man, it's getting pretty chilly. Oh, jeez. Man, winter really is coming. Well, if I, if I do remember correctly... Uh, Mr. Tree sort of sliced up <laughs> they sort of sliced up some beefaloes so we got shit tons of beefalo wool I'm sure that can make us something surely survival let's see here piggyback healing salve mmm straw roll tent umbrella bug net is there like a nice pimp jacket that we can make with all that beefalo wool Hmm. Hmm. Ooh. We're gonna have to want to be aware of the fact that it's nighttime now. We don't want this fire going out. Is it. Did I already check survival? Hmm. Light? I doubt it. Pumpkin lantern. A miner hat? Is it a tool? Ah, dress, of course. I don't I don't think I've ever checked this tab. Wow. A garland sewing kit. Rabbit earmuffs? <laughs> you just use two live rabbits? Oh, that's 
Interesting. Straw hat. A beefalo hat. There we go. Oh, and you use a beefalo horn as well. Huh. I wonder if that'd be good. It takes eight beefalo wool. Oh, man. I can't imagine what a, a full-on wool jacket would take then. Uh, you got a winter hat, which is four beefalo wool. And uh, some silk. Although it looks like the beefalo hat is probably better than the winter hat. I'd imagine. Oh, you can make a top hat. A walking cane, <laughs> a dapper vest, a breezy vest, a puffy vest, okay, warm enough for winter storms, okay, so the puffy vest requires some, some elephant trunk or something, I'm not sure if we can handle that, but, oh, our beard's back, let's shave that off, uh, and this might be the last shave before winter. And once winter's here, we're going to want to keep that beard around. Oh, nice. We got some rot. That's actually good for us. We could use some rot to fertilize a few things. There's our beard hair. And we might want to make that beefalo head as well. Oh, look at this stale meat. I totally forgot to eat it. All right, let's cook up this meat. Um, should we eat this? Let's eat this. I'll eat this. Yeah. And I'll actually cook up these two so they don't go bad. It looks like... It sort of restores a little bit of the goodness, so it's back in the green, and it'll last uh, a, a few more days, hopefully, and uh, that'll be great. That'll be great. Um, So today, what should we do today? Let's go pick some flowers real quick, because it looks like our sanity's taking a bit of a hit. So we should pick some flowers to get rid of these wobbles out here, and maybe gather some logs as well. Uh, we have three already. No. Oh. But we could always use more logs. Chop these trees down. What else can we make? I'm sure we can make more stuff, and I just haven't really... Let's go food. Drying rack. Ah, maybe we can make this. I think we have the rope for it. And as well, um, a crock pot? Oh, did it just pop up? Food. Oh, it's not showing it to me. I'm not sure why that is, but we should probably think about making that as well. I think you can get some pretty good food from that. And we might want to put it up by our food base as well. I think that'd be a good thing to have. In fact, we might as well make two. Uh, we have plenty of resources, I think. Well, I say that. I We, we actually are kind of short on resources. Uh, but let's gather some stuff. Keep venturing up north. I said we were going to go south, but I went north. And I'm sticking with that decision. Uh, to find some flowers, chop some trees, visit our food base, see if uh, Mr. Tree, Mr. Christmas, is making any progress on us. I don't think he is. He's pretty slow, and last time we saw him, he was by the beefaloes. Let's see here. Where are you at, Mr. Christmas Tree? Show yourself. Um, we, it also wouldn't hurt to get some grass. Oh, look, I forgot about all these traps. We have loads of traps up here. Yeah, we've got loads of food. Uh, we're probably going to want to make some clothes then. Something we can wear for winter. That wouldn't be a bad bet. Let's pick some more grass. How much grass do we have? We have 11 grass. Uh, can we make another farm? Do we have any poop with us? I don't think we do. And I don't think any's in the chest either. Let's run up here, grab some more grass. Do you see any... Do you see any flowers anywhere? I don't see any flowers. Hmm. Interesting. I wonder if the coming of winter begins killing all the... Oh. Begins killing all the flowers? Ah, oh, there's a flower. Never mind. I'm just going crazy. Let me grab this flower. Are there any more? Yeah, there's another flower. Our sanity from 25 to 30. Yeah, it heals five sanities. Pick this flower and this flower. All right. We got 140 sanity. We're doing great for sanity. What else can we get? Hmm. We might want to start heading back to our base. We uh, we didn't do much today. We did get some supplies, though. We didn't see Mr. Christmas, which might be a good sign, because that probably means he's still over by uh, the beefaloes. He's still, like, uh, washing, washing the blood off his claws. Uh, just licking his fingers with delight, knowing that he just 
completely wrecked an entire family of buffaloes, uh, sparing only the youngest to grow up to be the most troubled of the buffaloes. <laughs> oh my gosh. That was an unbelievable moment. Uh, let's see here. Beefalo hat. All right, let's, let's make that beefalo hat. It looked really warm, and it looks like something that we might be needing once winter shows up. I don't know how many days it'll be, but it's definitely cooling down. Yeah, look at the winterometer. Man, it's starting to get pretty chilly. Uh, eventually, we'll start taking taking hits as well from from the temperature. So it's probably best that we, we whip up this board and also go into dress. And uh, well, there's a straw hat, but we're, we want... What we want is a beefalo hat, which is... Where is it? Beefalo hat, beefalo hat. Man, some of this stuff isn't showing up, and I'm not sure why. Walking cane, dapper vest, breezy vest. Where is that beef? Oh, it's up further. What am I doing? Am I losing my mind? Okay. So we need this horn and this beefalo wool. Let's grab it out of the chest. We got the horn. We got the beefalo wool. Uh, it's turning to night soon. Let's throw this log or plank board on the fire. We'll go into this this nice looking top hat and ah oh man, it's not showing me. What's going on here? I I in good faith, I think this is the beefalo hat, so we're gonna make it. There we go. Oh my gosh, it looks great. Uh, we do look a bit insane though. We've got like red rings around our eyes. I'm not sure what that's all about. Let's eat eat this cooked meat. Eat one more cooked meat. All right, there we go. We got rid of all that cooked meat. Uh, sad to see it go, but man, we had that forever. That lasted us for many, many days. I'm pretty happy about that. Let's go into food and see what we can't do here. An ice box. We need gears. Um, although with winter coming, I'm not sure if we're gonna have to worry too much about an ice box. You know, I don't think we're gonna have to worry about our food going bad. Uh, but I am sort of worried about it just getting super, super cold. Is there any, like, uh, we've got a log suit. I'm not sure if that's going to help us too much in the way of, um, our, our body, though. Like, if there's a coat? I'm not sure if there's a coat we can wear. It didn't seem like it. At least I don't remember coming across any coats. We got a, this dapper vest. Hmm. What else is there? This puffy vest, but I'm not sure what what this coelophant trunk is. And a breezy vest requires the very same thing, only a, a red version? Ah, oh, winter coelophant trunk. Okay, well, I don't think that's going to be attainable. But we can probably get those gears. I think those gears we get from that springy, like, robot pope. Uh, those, like, chess piece those robotic chess pieces that were sort of bouncing around down there. I think we can go kill a couple of those with our fancy new... Ooh, this is losing health. I probably shouldn't wear that until it's winter time because that thing's uh, taking damage. It's taken 2% of its damage, and I'm not sure I did anything with it. Oh, do you hear... You know, I feel like everything's starting to get a bit bluer. I think winter might be here, or at least it's upon us. Oh, jeez. Uh, I'm coming down here to get gears. I said I didn't need them. Was there something else that I was coming down here for? I think it was just gears. Let's see. Let me... Let me th ooh. Yeah, I'll throw on this... Oh, dang it. Uh, I didn't realize I couldn't put my backpack in this hot bar. Alright, let's drop our backpack off back at the home base then. Where are we at? Alright, I think this is where we're going to want to go. I'm going to drop the backpack off at the home base. Oh, it is starting to get chilly. Let me grab this stone. We've got, oh, we've got loads of rocks. Also, I think there's a heating stone that might help. And speaking of, let me, let me plant these pine cones. Because we're going to need a close supply of wood come winter. And it's, yeah, it's, look at this guy. It's a big blue bird. Blue birds, uh, definitely are a sign of winter that's for sure so I'm gonna plant these trees hopefully I can get um, a nice close source of firewood going 
and sure. Now, drop the backpack off, put on the log suit. Maybe I can whoop some ass, get back to base, and uh, that'll be it for the day. Maybe I can, so today's goal, kill me some, some springy things. And I think that'll be good. So where are these guys at? They're down this way. Let's go get them. I think we can take them. Do you hear them? I think that's them. I think I hear them. Oh, is this a guy that we're going to want to attack? Oh my god, nope. Nope, he's not a guy we're going to want to attack. All right. Uh... I don't think he's doing a lot of damage, but it's re his attack is really frightening me. Oh my goodness. Is he going to pursue me forever? Alright, I think this is Marble Tree. I think this is the guy we're going to want to attack. Hopefully we can take him without... Yeah, let's get him. Oh yeah, he doesn't hit too hard. We can take him. Oh, but... Oh man, we can't take all these guys. Let's see if we can't... Oh no. Oh! Ooh, dodge that one. Okay, we got Robo Pope coming after us. Oh, get him, get him, get him. There we go. Oh, we got him. Oh no. Okay, he's coming after us, but we got we got the Robo the Robo, what are those called? The chess piece, the horse, but it's not called a horse. It's called something else. Is it a rook? Is it mm, I don't remember. Let's grab these gears and peace out. So we got two gears. Uh, we didn't take too much damage, so that's good. And we've we've made it away with our lives. And I'm pretty happy about that. Let's uh, pull out our axe and chop down some tree in celebration. Get a few more logs. And uh, really just prepare ourselves 100% for winter. Ooh, we can't carry... Is there anything we could drop? Anything worth... I don't know what this is for. But that doesn't necessarily mean it's something we should drop. So let's eat these... Oops eat these berries grab these logs and I I want this pine cone we're gonna want to plant some pine cones by our base so we can get that steady flow of trees going hmm oh and the crock pot that's a that's a definite I'd like to get that done tonight I don't know if we'll have time I need to whip up a torch burn down a tree do I have some charcoal already I'm not sure if I do or not I'll have to see let's check the chest see if we don't have Charcoal? Char no, no char. Oh man, we have loads of pine cones. I don't know why I bothered with that. <laughs> oh well. Uh, it's it's still good to have them. I've got 40 pine cones. Oh, there we go. These are turning into turning into big firewood trees. That's good. I don't think I'm ever gonna get that right. I don't think I'm ever gonna push that button correctly. It's right click, and I. Oh man, it's not that complicated. I'm just not very good. Refine, board. Um, I'll save the board for a bit, and let's see here. Let's go food. Where's this crock pot at? Oh my gosh, this is crock pot. All right. Yeah, you need charcoal. Six charcoal. Wow. So we need lots of charcoal. We need a few sticks. We've got plenty of cut stone. Let, let's check our chest to see if we don't have any sticks in there. I don't think we do. We've got loads of pine cones. We'll plant those in the morning. Let's throw together... A torch. Ah, oh, that's going to use all our sticks. So we're going to need all of the sticks. We're going to need uh, loads of charcoal. We're not going to want to burn these trees because they're the ones uh, close by our base uh, that we're going to use for, like, emergency firewood. So I'm going to throw on that board, stand by the fire, warm up. We've got our beefalo hat for when it really starts getting cold, and, and that really might happen soon. Any day now, it's going to start. It's really going to start snowing. And it's going to start freezing. Uh, but we are I think we're prepared. And I think we're ready for this. Let me see here. All our berry bushes are all fertilized. We got all those berry bushes up to the north as well. Right around here. Yeah, you can see them. Look at all that. Oh, we haven't been up there in a while. It's going to be great. This is where we're at now. Um, oh, I, we're totally ready for winter. I feel like we could use more stuff, though. Doesn't it seem a little bare here? I just kind of want to build something for the sake of it you know having a fuller base maybe we could make some walls what does it take to make some walls structures hay wall hay wall segments not very sturdy we want some sturdy stuff maybe wooden maybe we could go for wooden but ah, two boards that's a lot of wood 
Hmm. What does it take to make... I'm gonna have to... A stone wall. A pig house. A bird cage. Cobblestones. Oh, for like a road. That'd be nice. And some nice wood flooring. Huh. It only takes a single board. Oh, that'd be great. Let's make ourselves like a nice little cottage down here. I think that'd be nice, and I think that'd liven this place up. So, ah, oh man, we keep piling stuff onto our plate, though. We're really going to have to concentrate. It's either make a crock pot in the morning or make a house in the morning. Hmm, this is going to be a tough call. And I think, uh, ultimately, that's going to be a decision for us to make next time. So I think I'm going to wrap up this episode there. Uh, it's sort of a boring episode. I'm sorry about that. But, you know, we had some groundskeeping to do. You know, it, it can't all be action. Sometimes you just kind of have to run around, collect some berries, get some gears for a reason that you don't really understand all that well. Um, <laughs> and just sort of prepare... prepare oh. Oh man, I said it wasn't going to be a very interesting episode, but here we hear this sound again. Ah, it's this hand. Get out of here, you stupid hand. Fuck off. <laughs> I don't want you around here. You can't steal my fire. Get out of here. <laughs> we'll step on his hand. We'll wait for him. He'll think he's got it. He'll think he's got it. Get out of here. Get out of here, you son of a bitch. Stupid hand. Ah. Can't believe... He, um, this hand, there, there were two of these hands, and they nearly stole my fire and got me killed. Oh, that was probably the most frightening moment yet. Yeah, so I'm going to leave it there. This hand's not going to get me in the meantime. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns about life, post it in the comments, and uh, I'll definitely get to it and, uh, and solve all your problems. So thanks for watching, have a great day, and I'll see you later.